Hello, world. What do we have here? Starting from the get-go. <laughs> oh, jeez. So, huge update to Railroads Online. I have not checked it out. You're going to get my true first impressions. I uh, watched the video from Sandy yesterday. It looks awesome. The new map looks great. Seems like we got another few months of playing on this, huh? Now, I'm sure Railroads Online doesn't work. Good try, though. Oh, it, it attached. It attached. Let's see. Uh, let me show you guys. Owner here. I don't, I don't expect this to work. But I can cheat and give myself the money. That's what I'm going to do. I'm not. I ain't starting from the beginning. I want the good stuff right off the bat, man. All right, we're going to pick a, a starting loco. It's going to be Betsy. And here we are. Let's see. F1. Click. Control R. F1. Oh, look. Mm, extended's working. Got to be careful, though. We can fly. Let's see if we can fly. Increase money by 300,000. <laughs> Submit. Take that out. Increase XP by 300,000. Yes, I did this all dirty. Um, close this. P. I got money, baby. <laughs> I'm a pro. <laughs> and we are flying. Oh, look at it. Look, would you just look at it? Look at it. Do we want to play the stock map? So, hmm. Wheat farm, iron smelter, refinery. I don't know. I don't know <clears throat> the best order. Railway Express Agency. The best order to go about um, doing stuff. I, I want to see the dredge. I want to see the dredge. That's what I want to see. Is over here by this lake. I love the fact that there's three lakes. That's the is that the meat packing? Yep. Oh, look at the look at the the river and the waterfalls. It's almost like they were listening to me. Let's check this first before we check the dredge. All right, that doesn't suck. You know, we're coming through here with a train track. Train track. Now, okay, first complaint or first suggestion, however you want to take it. These dredges used to make, uh, they make square cuts into the landscape to do their dredging. And then they have pools for the water to go to. Let's see. G menu. At least it is a new new menu. Player interaction. Open abilities menu. Oh, abilities. Tree. What is this? Rerail. And what is that? Delete stuff. Demolish, switch, demo type, T, groundwork, bridge, facilities, and then back. Okay. 
that works. Open construction menu, G. Industries. They're all there. Oh, look, you can place another dredge. That's kind of cool, actually. We can have more than one dredge. Uh, all my freaking keybinds are different. Oh, wait. How do you rotate now? They changed everything. Eight and two. Eight and two. What? Zero. Eight and two. I'm so confused. 94 and six. So it's number pad now. So if we were to place this. Oh, look. Pile of... Mm. All right. <laughs> We're in the water. That's cool. Can we interact with this? Does this have... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on. No, you want to. It wants to carry me up. We're already trying to break the game. Already trying to break the game. Oh my god, it's night already. Wait a second. Options. <clears throat> Gameplay, custom weather, get over here, day length, 20, better, what, what, options, gameplay, oh, yeah, should be like 6.30 in the morning. Okay, now I am over this thing. Let's see if I can... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We are going in. We're going in. Going in. <laughs> oh. Where are we? The lantern on. This is it. We are inside the dredge. That's where you die, right there. Oh. Now outside the dredge. Oh, this is cool. You can kind of walk around it. Open the door, please. Nice. That's cool. But well, we don't need two dredges. So. Oh. T. Demolish. Ooh. Okay. We can also right click to get out of that. Nice. All right, let's go check out some other stuff. Just in the checking out mode here. Let's go check out this, the Railway Express Agency. Let's see where this river pours in over here. Nifty. Look at this little ridge here. Where is this place? 
probably that's it right there. This map is big because I am in the fast flying mode. I suppose we can go right into this one. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's got noise. Nice. Nice touch. Give me that. Give me the money. I quit my job. Oh, they don't. You can't get in this room. Nope. Can't get in that room either. What's in? The, what's in those rooms? Hmm. Oh, look. They won't even third person let you get in there. Right. How you doing? How you doing? I have to sign into this shit again. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all right. We can't see what's in those rooms. Go through these doors. They can make doors open. What? Huh? What? What you doing? It? Hmm. Where's your hat, buddy? Where is your hat? This guy needs a name. Uh... Oh yeah, here we go. Let's take care of business here. Oh darn it. You saw what I was doing, right? You can't put a space? Why can't you put a space? In the text. Hungry underscore need underscore food. Can I lower this? How do you lower this? Is there a way to lower this? What's this number five to do thing? I pressed five and it didn't do anything. The sign's not going to be low enough. Maybe at some point we could figure out how to lower it. There you go, bud. Is this double sided? I can't. Can't put writing on the other side? Alright. Enough of that. Wait a second. Oh, chat. What's up? Going to Joe soon? What? Gotta tell Joe extended working. Oh. What's up, guys? I didn't have my chat box open. Sorry. Not playable yet? What do you mean not playable yet? What are you talking about? The extended is working. I only need this. The money. And that's it, really. Operating switches remote is not the most important thing. Alright, what else we got to check out? Stamp mill. Let's go check out the stamp mill. Sorry, guys. I, I committed a carnal sin. I wasn't paying attention to my chat. Where are we? Oh, we got to go this way.
this is it. This is the new thingy. So, show info. Oh, look, even the info works for this. So, input, there's two inputs, I don't know what they are coal, cordwood. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> so over here, let's put this on center. All right, so if you click on this and show, show info, it gives you the info. There you go. I'm using uh, F1 menus. It doesn't show on my stream or the recording. Hmm. What do we have here? Can this kill you? Oh, yeah. We're getting hammered here. This game needs to have death in it. Like if you get run over by a train or something. Ooh, look at all this shit. Hmm. Okay, that's interesting. That's just interesting. Get your wiener caught in there. Nifty. So what we got? Refined gold. Cord wood. Coal. So it's just coal and cord wood we gotta bring here? That's it? Oh, we gotta bring water and gold ore okay nice four inputs holy smokes all right any other places we got to check out the gold smelter and the gold mine gold smelter let's check it You're going in the right direction? Yes. Uh, I cannot go any higher than this. Tell me this is the ceiling. That's it. This is the ceiling. Hmm. Is this the smelter over here? Yeah. Look at this high mountain lake. Why didn't they put... You know, if they do the weather, this should have waves. I mean, it does have a little bit of waves, but not... Go into weather. Graphics. Oh god, I'm in 2K. That's fine for now. Okay, graphics. Okay, everything is good. Frame rate, unlimited. Let's lock it at 120. We don't need to go more than 120. <clears throat> I don't know my frame rate because I didn't do the thing in Steam. Uh, gameplay. Other conditions. Heavy snow. Okay, here's the gold smelter.
We got a lot of places to bring coal now. Put this here, but nothing comes out of it. Okay. Oh, here's another dude. What's up, dude? Like, they couldn't... There's so many characters they could have bought. Let's see. Gold ingots. That's a security guard. I put a sign there. We're already building our railway. This is important. <laughs> you find gold chain man the chain so really it just needs coal and refined gold all right we got to check out one more the gold mine over this way more this way. Look at the nice river. There's the gold mine. Gold ore. So what do you got to bring here? Coal. Beams. Rails. And tools. Wow. We need a lot of stuff here. Oh my god. They're crazy. They are crazy. So let's go see if the snow accumulated on the lowlands. Which way am I going? <clears throat> oh, we could just click this. Oh, yeah, look, the snow accumulated. So, I don't have a plow. What happens if you don't have a plow? I can't. Oh, there we go. I want you to put your hand on the handle. Silly. Silly, silly, silly. Let's see. So nothing happens if you don't have a plow. Okay, 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 okay. And if I add track to this right now. It's going to be covered in snow automatically. Uh, how do you lock? Five. It's a little different now. All the buttons. Now I have to... Take my hand off the mouse. All right, we just want that there. Let's see if the snow accumulates on that. Are we under the ground? I can't tell. We should not be under the ground. Oh, look, at, look at the new logo. Look at that. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, a different kind of bell. Lots of headlight choices. Ten headlight choices. The paint schemes are awesome.
do not want to we want a snow plow right now. We got this sucker. Only two paint schemes. No. Order. Wow, this thing is huge. I don't mean, why don't... Uh, it's just because I'm looking at Betsy, right? Oh my goodness. Um. Houston, we have a problem. one of these is going to cost more. Can we not hook this to Betsy? It's plowing. It's going to go all the way to the end. Fall off the track. Like Betsy could push this. <laughs> How do you link these two? I guess they don't. They don't link. This won't link to that. This won't link to that. You don't miss. Oh, oh, snap. That was that was a pain in the ass. All right. Uh, we might be going a little too fast. Alright, so now... Oops. I didn't mean to do that. Um, stop doing it. Is the snow accumulating again after you plow it? Or do you have to recreate the storm? Gameplay. Let's go with the blizzard. Oh my god. not really accumulating there is like a circle are you accumulating All right, let's go to clear skies <laughs> cloud marks Guess you bought the snow pack.
did they add any crossovers or anything? All right. It's all melting away. Very cool, very cool. Let's check out the snow track. Uh, this menu's messed up here. Look at that. Hmm. Look, they give us this water tower now. I guess my yard is going out that way. All right, let's bring the snow back. Is there any new? No. Everything is the same. Heavy snow. Let's see how long it takes to accumulate. We're testing the waters here. Oh, you just have to click it now. You don't have to drag. Just... Oh, barely have to move the mouse. Okay, so see, now that the track is laid, now the snow accumulates on it. And I think once you clear it, that's it. You don't have to clear it again. Betsy can push a snowplow. Doesn't accumulate on the end track. Look. Oh, they said it wouldn't accumulate on switches and stuff due to graphical issues. Can you straighten those issues out? All right. So wait. I spent six hundred dollars. Okay, they still start you with the two thousand. By the way, all right. So it's not accumulating again. So if it's not accumulating, is the snowplow going to give? Give the uh, the animation. Yep. Okay, next test. Go to clear skies. And where is the logging camp, by the way? Not too far. Let's go take a look and see. Oh, we gotta go while the snow melts. Am I going in the right direction? No, nope, it's this way. Wheat farm is close. Gotta go more this way. Guess we're coming through this cut. 
Ooh, no, this cut doesn't back up. Got to go through this cut. There she is. Uh, I'm building track to a logging camp again. That's what I'm doing. Star changes the grid. I don't like this. On the number pad. To be honest. I think this has to be kind of far out, right? Why can't I operate this? It's not letting me operate. Does a car have to be here? So I can't test anymore? You cannot operate this, I guess, unless a car is here. So we just have to guess. <laughs> All right. Fine. Get out about here. Oh my God. I prefer my old controls, to be honest. In fact, let's take a look at that. Options, controls. Reset input. That's all new. Enter vehicle, close regulator, open regulator, exit the locomotive. Hmm. Toggle UI. Player interaction one, player interaction two. What is gamepad right trigger? I don't have a gamepad. So it would have been nice if they explained what that was. Toggle, unload, cargo. Putting my old Oh and if then if you reset it goes back to the original. Okay. Camera sensitivity. Yeah. Okay. This is gonna be two. It's gonna be three. I don't, I don't like this number pad thing. Let's see. Increase rotation. I believe it was... Why couldn't I use left and right? Right. Increase. Decrease. Toggle circle mode. J. 
increase curve radius, increase switch type, and a construction grid. That was the middle mouse button for me. I probably screwed up a whole other thing. Uh, I don't know if I have this right or not, but we'll see. Um, okay. That's the way I remember it. Let's get track here. Toggle circle mode. Increase curve. Uh, B and then what is going on? Can you actually lay that? That is really odd. B N What is the six meter thing? Oh, that's the length. Okay. Is it just this tree here that's messing me up? Had our first casualties. Okay, lock this in. ZC. Oh yeah, it's working. Okay, this is the way I remember it. Okay, okay. Okay, we're good. Evil Rock. I think somewhere about there. Should be right. Hmm. I don't know where we're going with this. We have to go somewhere else after here? No. There's nowhere to go from here. God, imagine if we had to walk around at regular speed. I wouldn't be playing the game right now. <laughs> uh, sorry. <laughs> it's not. I need to do things at a certain pace. Stick to rails. Oh. I hit the H button, so I gotta move that. The wiki has to be on a different. Because I'll hit that all the time. Open wiki. Uh, we'll make that like left bracket. I never have to hit that shit. You know what's amazing? Also, like, there's no fluidity. There's no consistency. To like, so like if you go, you can use escape to get out of that. But if you hit escape and then go into options, you can't use escape to get out of this. It should be like the same button for all things, man.
that's uh, I don't know German engineering it's awesome and overly complicated it sometimes that's what I feel I don't know I could be wrong about that maybe I'm being racist if I am I'm sorry I mean it in a nice way All right, we are on our way. So I'm slow here. And let's start laying some track. Are you coming with me? Let's see. Okay, stop. Gotta start going down from this point here. I think we'll make two percent max grade, maybe. Where am I going? Going in the right direction. You're watching me on YouTube. Let me know if you're new to the game. You have tutorials. I do. And they'll work. They'll work for this map. Holy smokes, where we gotta go? Where do we go from here? Guess we're gonna hug this mountain here. We disappeared. We will go here. And go down at two percent. We're above the ground so it's not placing. Oh, every time you pick a new piece, the, uh, the grade resets. I think that was like that, right? That was like that. Oh, my God. Wait, wait a second. Where do we have to go? I didn't really plot this out. We have... So we're going to have to, like, go all the way around hugging this mountain. That's what's got to happen, I guess. Maybe we just go to 4%. We got powerful engines now. <clears throat> One and a half, two percent is boring. Let's go 4%. At least. Uh, minimum radius. We should definitely be around 60. Sixty is good. I'm gonna come back and cut all these trees.
we technically never finished our old map. We're starting the new map. But I mean, hey, look at all the stuff we got. Play with here. Why wouldn't I start a new map? It's a new map. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm dummy. Got to reset the grade every time. Like wondering why we're not going down. Every time, gotta reset the. We'll get down, bring her down, bring her, bring her down safe. Here. Just clipping that rock. You don't want to clip rocks. So we'll go here. I'm still at 4% since I stayed with the same track. Sometimes you got to go around the hill. Still at four percent. Yep. And we're gonna have a hill to climb. Holy, holy smokes! Oh, it's not placing. So we need bridge here. Need some bridge. Mm, which one? one? Set the grade. This is even too tall for that bridge. So, this bridge. Think. Yeah, that little cutout was a little difficult there. Four percent, man. Holy smokes.
clear. That noise just scared the fucking shit out of me. <laughs> Iron Eye, you motherfucker. You almost gave me a heart attack. I think I'm a disable sound alerts. That is really not healthy for me. Oh. Wow. That was so loud in my headphones. Why was it so loud? Alright, I'm in my Discord if you want to talk. That was so loud. I thought the world was exploding behind me. Jesus Christ. Hmm. What a conundrum. You uh you got me uh really good there, mister. You haven't been around, so kind of, uh, nobody's been doing that. So why is it so loud? Like, can I adjust the sound of the sound alerts in my OBS? Where do I adjust that? Because that was a little on the loud side. My volumes recently got like screwed up. Sound alerts. Okay, here we go. Properties. Uh, control audio via OBS. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. How do I control via OBS? Okay. Oh, there we go. Sound alerts. Ah. Now I have a volume slider. God, I am not uh, okay. How come I can't play sound alerts here? Strange. Strange. Back over here. It's not working. Not working either. My browser is not working. Try this. Let's try this. Interesting. But you played the steam whistle, but now I don't hear it. I just played it, too. Something happened, now I don't hear nothing. Great. I want to hear it. Hold on. Whatever. Back to building. Forget about sound alerts for the moment. I will restart. OBS and see if that fixes it. Because I uh, checked the option to control sound alerts via OBS and then it fucked it up. My soundboard also crashed on, on the browser. I don't know why. 
to you. That has to be a bridge. Squirrely. And it's a long way up to the logging camp. So the beginners now that start this game, they have to build up. That's cool. Screw them beginners. If you don't know about building up, don't play the game. <laughs> so cruel. Everything is a grade, right? That's a long way down. That last piece looks level. No, it doesn't. My imagination. Yeah, I don't. I don't hear the sounds. Iron Eye. Save your money. I don't hear much of anything. Excuse me, tree. Out of my face. Unless there was an easier way to go that I don't know about. I don't think so. Let's see. The logging camp is over there. It's kind of in... A little valley. We could have came out this way. Would have been the other way. Where's the sawmill? Sawmill. Oh, we're going towards the sawmill anyway. So, this is good. I'm, I'm going to set up this map for efficiency and not be crazy with it. There he is. Good day, my friend. Good day. How are you, man? I was just asking about you yesterday. I was like, where is, where is my buddy Iron Eye? <laughs> well, how you been? Oh, it's been awesome. Hmm. Have you been streaming? No. Oh. Why not? Because <clears throat> January is a bad month for me, and February is where all my medical shit starts to happen again for the new year. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. I hate going to see doctors. I went to an optometrist yesterday. Or but, today. Okay. Yeah, now I gotta wear fucking glasses. Yeah. <laughs> you said glasses, and I realized I have my wrong glasses on. I have two pairs. One for computer. That's better. And one for... Yeah, one for seeing far. Yeah. I'm nearsighted, so... But even even that's changing. Like, I can only... Yeah. There's a certain distance, like maybe arm's length, or a little shorter than arm's length, oh, is, yeah. is about where I, my vision is still good. The thing is, is they 
I have to wear these where there's two different types of glasses in the one where it has a slit in the middle. Oh, I, I can't do I can't deal with those. Cannot do. Yeah, bifocals. Yeah, my daughter's all over it. Like she does. Like you, she says, "Dad, you're getting old. You gotta wear bifocals." No, no. Yeah, this is. I'm not gonna fucking wear them. Nope. <laughs> I I ordered them last time I went for glasses, <clears throat> and I put them on, and I immediately like I got dizzy. I wanted to throw up. Yeah. Yeah, I could not deal with it. And then they were like, oh, no, you have to get used to it. You know, like the, the lady was arguing with me, like, it's you. It's not the glasses. And I'm like, and I'm like, I can see out the side of the glasses and see that, like, if I look out the side of the frames and I look at, at like an edge, right? Like the floor where, where a wood floor meets a carpet or something, that that edge is like, you know, a foot away from the edge I'm seeing in the glasses. Right. And I have good peripheral, so I can, you know, like, it affects me. Like, I see everything. I don't just see what I'm looking at. They're like, you have to learn to look through the part of the glass. I'm like, no, but that's not how my eyes work. I drive, and I need to see to the side and stuff. Yep. I look to the side. It's like vertigo, like motion sickness, really bad, really bad. I was like, no, not doing it. <laughs> I, I, I've, I've never worn glasses in my life until I came to this city. We blaming it on the city, huh? Yeah, I am. <laughs> how come? <laughs> because they, they started talking about how there's too much iron or lead and shit in the water. Oh. Here, right? And I'm like, well, they never did that in, in the other city I lived in. You drink, you drink the city water? Well, I did when I first moved here, right? Right. Because I, I, I'm, I was a stickler for I'm not gonna pay for water when I get water out of the tap or drink. Oh, I don't trust fucking city water. Yeah, I don't trust it no more. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when I worked in a nursing home, I was I had to manage over a million gallons of water tower and well and everything, and the water came from a lake, was treated. And then had time to sit in the pipe, and I got the the reports and the tanks, and I was like, no, there's no fucking way I will ever drink this shit. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know? Yeah. yeah, when you when you know, it's it's one of those things, right? And the government's saying it's safe. Yeah, right. But then at the same time, so like, here's the thing, right? There was um, there's a condition where if you chlorinate water. And the water has a lot of biologicals in it. Like it comes from a lake. Yeah. So what happens is it kills those biologicals. And those biologicals uh, turn into something else. <laughs> that can cause cancer if they sit in the pipe too long. Right? Uh, triamethyl, something like that. I, I'm not good with words, right? It, try triamethyl something, right? Yeah, yeah. And uh, so we would get the, and in the summertime, it's worse because there's more biologicals growing in the lake. And um, <clears throat> so we would get noticed, like, because the, the, the state comes and tests our water and get a notice, oh, they're too high, it can cause cancer, you don't need to worry at this moment, blah, 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 right? And then the same agency that gave us the notice I wanted to get carbon filtration for our facility. That was my solution. I want to get a big, elaborate carbon filtration system that automatically back flushes and everything. I'm like, this is going to give us the best water, you know, and then we could re rechlorinate the recommended amount. And uh, so the agency that was giving us the notices took my uh, engineering designs for the carbon filtration and put them to the side for like years, but still kept sending me fucking notices. <laughs> Yeah. I'm like, how, why are you sending me notices when, like, we could fix this, right? Oh, my God. It was so... So just watching that whole process of how that happens yeah. left me zero confidence in any kind of city water. Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't... It I won't like It's a money scam. No. I use a Brita filter, you know? Yep. Well, these glasses I got, they're not friggin' cheap. No. They're just going to sit in their little box and sit on the table here. And... Why? What do you need them for? For reading? 
Yeah, I don't need them for driving, and I don't need them for uh, everyday use. It's just for reading. Oh, you're driving again, right? Yep. Nice. Nice. Yep, I'm back driving. Well, I, I can't I can't stand somebody else driving when I'm in the car. Yeah, right? I, yeah, you drove trucks for all those years, so yeah. you know the road. Yeah, I can't, I can't, no. <laughs> Get the fuck out of that seat. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it makes you sick, right? Unless the person really knows how to drive. Well, I learned from my stepdad, but you know, it's it's he's he's like in his seventies, right? Right. And it's like, no, dad. You don't have taught me how to drive when I was a kid, but since I've been driving, I have more experience than you. Yeah. <laughs> and plus, you get older, so you don't you start to lose it. Yeah. Yeah. Reaction times go down. Do for him. Yeah, seventy. I hope I can still drive when I'm seventy. <laughs> well, I'm approaching fast. <laughs> Gonna be fifty-nine this year. <laughs> it's not that. I thought I was older than you. No, sir. Oh, I'm the old guy here. Respect your elders, Iron Eye. <laughs> 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 oh, I'm in the middle then. I'm older than Joel. Oh, Disney dude's older than I am. Yeah, Disney dude's got both of us speed. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And he's still working. Yeah. Yeah, they, they, uh, I thought I told you they gave me back my license and everything. Yeah, I think you did. You did. So, a new map, eh? Yeah, I did a whole little tour of it with all the new industries and stuff. And now I'm, I guess the first thing we got to do again is logging camp and. Yeah. I've got you and I was, I, I was in chatting with Mr. Joe. Right. And then I saw that you came, you were on and I'm like, oh, I got to stop in and say hi. I didn't get a notice that Joe was streaming. That's weird. I don't get a notice for any of you guys. I do when Joe streams. But I didn't get one today, unless, let's see, wait a second. Oh, no, I did, at 1 o'clock. Yeah, I, I think I had already started. Yeah, I've been, stream. yeah, I've been streaming. I started streaming two minutes before he did. <laughs> That's funny. You're both on at the same time. You guys need two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I didn't see the notice. I didn't check the emails. <clears throat> that is funny. All right, let's get away from the mountain here. Yeah, my daughter's just loving it. She's laughing her ass off about me having her glasses. These friggin' things are expensive. I didn't think they'd be that much. How much? $600. Oh, you pay too much. Yeah. No. $600 too much. Yeah, mm, I think I paid three something. Yeah, I think I, I I paid four hundred for three pairs of glasses. For three? Yeah, I got one. Oh man. One 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 for the computer, which was really cheap because the frames were actually five bucks. Because I don't, yeah. I'm not going out in front of anybody. I don't care what they look like. It's yeah. just for home in front of the computer. Yeah. Then I got a nice set of like, they look like graphite, carbon graphite. Just then you my prescription and my and the money and you get them for. For drive for Walmart. You go to Walmart. You got Walmart up there. That's where I went. Oh man. Yeah, six hundred dollars for the friggin' thing. What about online? You can shop online. Well, that's what we were thinking, but my daughter doesn't want to do that in case because uh, the neighbor, the my neighbor. Uh, oh, yeah, 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 that's right. You have problems. Yeah. You're going to steal your glasses. <laughs> uh, well, you never know, right? Right. You take anything that comes from uh, Amazon. Put a little trail, put a little trail cam, put a little trail cam there somewhere and uh, order some cheap stuff, like a couple bucks, 
and then bust and bust them. Well, that's what I was thinking about doing. Yeah, bust them, and then he'll uh, he'll have to stop doing it. Because that'd be what one of those animal uh, cams, right? Yeah. Yeah, you can find them for like forty bucks. Yeah. Well, yep. You just gotta hide it somewhere though, where he can't see it. Well, that's easy. Big friggin' tree right in front of the house. Right. Point it down at the door where the where the guy brings it. Right. And it's all wireless. The cam just records, so they have other ones that will send you a picture to your cell phone. Uh, you'll get like a hundred free pictures, I think, when you buy the buy it. I think I bought mine. That one I bought for like two hundred, and then I pay because I have one on my house upstate. So I pay like a hundred dollars a year, and I get two hundred and fifty photos a month, and fifty full high definition photos for the year. But that that's that's a good thing. All I gotta do is catch them once. Right. right. Well, you catch them once, right? Yeah. And then you yeah. test them a few more times. But some people don't know how to stop. Right. But if you got I mean if you catch them once and call the police. Well, I'll just catch them and then I'll beat the shit out of them. Take oh. Them. There you go. Fuck. There's that too. Yeah, you're going to get beat up. Yeah. The only thing is, you know, when you take the law into your old, your own hands these days, yeah. the asshole government and courts and stuff, no, no, he... they will, they'll make you the fucking, the, the uh, perpetrator. Yeah, well, he's too afraid of the cops, too. Because I guess they had animal control on them for a little while, and they wouldn't answer the door. Oh, yeah? I come home one night, and here's this guy in the backyard, full animal control gear, everything. I thought it was a cop at first. I'm like, who the fuck are you? And what the fuck are you doing on my property? Right? And the, the guy goes, I'm here, animal control. I want to see, do you live here? I go, yeah, I live in the basement. And there's no fucking animals there, there. Yeah. So what, this, this guy had, like, illegal animals or not taking care of them or something? Not licensed. Oh, they got to be licensed. Yeah. That's so dumb. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah. If, even if you get a cat, because we were thinking about getting a cat, right? Right. You have to, you have to get tagged for your cat, <laughs> depending on the type of cat you get, right? Right. You have to put a chip in it. Oh, my God. Well, I would want the chip just to find him if he got out, right? Yeah. But uh, because the type of cat that I'm looking at getting, it's uh, I'll, I'll send you a DM of one. What's it called? Uh, I, I don't know. Chip cat. <laughs> it's a chip cat. My daughter knows them off by heart. It's eye cat. But they're they're a nice looking animal. I only know a few different cat breeds. I'm no expert on cats either. I'll send you a DM. Look, we still gotta go down more here. There it is. Getting my bearings. Got a little drop off here. I just like the way this cat looks. And from what I'm told, uh they're like they're like a. They sit. They stand uh, fully grown. They're like two feet off the ground. Their body comes up two feet off the ground. Oh yeah. Yeah, from what I'm told, anyways. Why can't I place this? So I sent you a DM of what they look like. We gotta put a little section first. The spline was uh, going through the ground. Yeah. I thought they were doing something with the spline this time. Nope. Everything, all the track. They added, um. New cars. New snow cars. track. Yeah, they added that. They added the snow track. Hmm. 
Ooh, that's pretty nice. Yeah, so I thought I'd just step in and say hi. I gotta go and do the rest of my medical today, and then I'm done for now till next year. Good. Take care of yourself, brother. Always. Yeah. You do too. Yeah, I know, right? Thank you. Uh, us older folks, it, it ten, life tends to get a little slower. Yeah. Like you were saying earlier, you start to slow down a little bit. I was doing pretty good, and then I caught like a cold over the weekend or something. Uh, but I will I'll give you some good news. I'm back up. I walk. I go for walks now. Like, oh, nice. I'm walking around. Uh, I started walking the block. Where it's, it's only a little block. Like it, it, I'm back within 20 minutes if I just go around the block. But now I'm walking a little further. Trying out to walk up hills a little bit. And stuff, and uh, yeah, I'll keep you posted on what's happening. And... That's great news, man. Yeah. And then I get told I gotta wear glasses. You got told. Yeah, I got told. Like, uh, is that on your license now? Like you have to wear them for driving? No, I don't need them for that. It's just for reading and oh, and stuff like that. But that's where it starts, right? The moment you start wearing glasses. I don't know. Don't I, think, think so? I, I think your eyes decline <laughs> no matter what. Yeah. Yeah, but at, at my age, that, that that seems to be the, from what he, the doctor says, this is the time where it starts to decline, right? Right. But I just, I think it's because of the water in this fucking city, I'm telling you. I had first year six months of drinking their water and then i heard they had lead in the water oh time to stop and they started buying water and Man. we spend all this money on all this other shit yeah, they can't yeah. fix our fucking water yeah it's yeah. ridiculous man yeah not trying to be political i'm just trying to be common sense here you know yeah it's, you, you, you pay them right and you go why can't you fix this right like you know it's it's you tear up the roads, so at the same time, why don't you put in the piping, you know, to rectify that when you when you tear up the roads 10 million times a year. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Especially yeah. my road. It's like almost every year this, this road out front here is tore up and redone. Because it's the highway, right? It's a main, main, major artery. Right, and it gets cold, and they use a lot of salt and chains. Do they have the, do they have chain laws there and stuff? Well, if you're going on from this highway to the 401, you have to. You got to have chains at least carry them with you, or snow tires, right? Yeah. Stuff like that. Yeah, which chews up the road, right? Right. Heat. Yeah. Like it's not. Yep. So, yeah. You'd think that they'd find something for trucks a little better than than chains. But hey, it's been working for ever since the trucks been made. So. Right. You ever see a, a snow sock for a car? Yeah, I have. That's like that's, that's weird. It's pretty cool. But they, you know, like they. I watched this guy on YouTube. He tested it. And uh, it did really well in the tests. But I was like, you know, you're, you're testing it on, like, he was in Colorado. He was like, dry, snow. I'm like, you're not, if you get in, come here in New York City and get in the slush, those those things, they're not doing anything, you know? I saw those in uh, Fort Hope in um, BC, British Columbia. Right. Where uh, I was watching uh, an episode of um, that Jamie Jamie's towing. Jamie. Through hell, highway through hell. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I like that show. Yeah, and they were talking about how truck drivers have these things called socks instead of chains, and they're showing them. I'm like, I can't see that. 
doing too well in about four feet of snow. No, and it does about as good as a dedicated snow tire. Yeah. A little bit better. That's that's it, and you can't go fast. Well, it has to have something on it to be like a granule, right? Like something to grab. Right. The thing is, if you're in icy conditions or slushy conditions, it's going to just clog up. Right. That's why you need the chains. The chains is the only thing that can really break stuff up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You know? It breaks ice, right? Like it uses the weight of the vehicle to break the ice. Right. Let's see, we want this here, like this. Yeah, I'm going to be coming back streaming at the end of February. Oh, okay. I miss, I miss doing streams. I just, uh, I, while I'm doing stuff like this, it's because it, I'm up in the daytime and it's not where my comfortability time is. Right. I like to be comfortable and at night. Why is this track curved? Oh, because I would use J. Gotcha. I was in circle mode. Oops. Okay, buddy. I'll yep. All right, man. Have a good one. We're going to have to make a little island tr retreat out on this uh, island. Does this island have... Oh, it's a lagoon. Interesting. Is this an island? Oh, man. Give me an ATV. I want to ride through here. It's not an island. Look at this from above. It is not an island. We have any industries over here? Where are we? Oh, sawmill, water well. They put the water well over here, the sneaky bastards. But we just gotta we gotta finish this line. This is sawmill. And build back to the uh, the main yard so we can get a train here. And we can do a log run. That's it. That's an hour and a half right there. That's good for YouTube. Give me a second here, guys. Let's start part two.